Hey everyone, Matt here again, and right now we're going to do a deep dive analysis on The Who. Live, 1978 at Shepperton Studios, playing one of their most famous songs, Won't Get Fooled Again. One of the most famous A chords ever strummed starts this song off. So, upon no further ado, let's get rolling. Let's see what The Who is up to right now. Here we go. Here it is. Pete Townsend, man, he's energized. He's dancing around, trying to get the crowd going to the backing track. Keith Moon is playing air drums right now. <laughs> what a nut. These guys are these guys are so much energy. There's that A chord again. G to D A G D A. Look at that, the windmill. Vintage, classic, the P Townsend windmill. Jumping up in the air. Look at that. So much energy. Who's that peeking his head back there? Who is that? Okay, here's something funny is uh, we got Ant Whistle, the bass player. I mean, he is just calm as can be if I can get to that part again here. Let's see. That. Look at that. Everyone else has crazy energy, right? I mean, Pete Townsend has crazy energy. Um, Roger Daltrey, Daltrey, the lead singer, he's getting into it. Keith Moon, obviously, he's moving around. But look at Ant Whistle. He's just smooth. His fingers are the only thing that is uh, outputting energy. Great vocal duo, duo right here, too. Pete Townsend and Daltrey. Yeah. Little lead fills there by Townsend. Yeah, some shredding. <laughs> awesome, Pete. He was shredding, man. You could hear that? Man, look at all that energy. And Whistle's like, yeah, I'm, I'm all right. I'm just gonna jam out here. There was some more windmills. I could see that. <laughs> Moon's smiling. Moon's having fun. Look at, okay, so look at Moon. Crash symbol, crash symbol. Crash symbol, crash symbol. I think he's got a, like a hi-hat hidden, but I don't even think, I honestly don't even think he hits his hi-hat this whole song. It's all crashes, and if there's a ride symbol, it's probably a, a crash ride. I mean, look at that. I don't see a hi-hat. Yeah, I, maybe that's it, buried back there. Let's watch it again. You can see Keith Moon just clasps the hi-hat barely as he, after this fill. Oh, unless he just hit it by accident. Awesome bass work. So the Who, I believe, have been around since the early 60s, and so this is, what, like 15 years into it or so? I mean, the camaraderie is amazing. All, like, one cohesive unit. And they're, man, are they just holding all the rhythmic parts together. There's no deviation from rhythm. It's amazing, all the energy output, and they're able to stay on time with 
all that they're playing. Amazing. Amazing work, guys. Yeah, look at that pace work. I'm mesmerized by that. Here we go, a little key change. Oh, never mind. Solo. Townsend. Showing it off. Here we go. Key change. E chord. There we go. Back to the A chord. Is that a B chord there? Yeah. B chord, A, E. Some more, some more soloing. Some double stops there. Again, they're doing some different things than the studio version, which is always a pleasure to hear when, when you see live bands. Oh, he's having fun with it. Wow, bashing his head against the guitar. Get that A chord out. Ed Whistle just won't stop. Back into it again. Where's that scream, Daltrey? Let's hear it. Oh, he doesn't do it yet. Oh, look at those windmills. This song is classic for the windmills. Wow, way up on the fretboard there. Nice job, that whistle. Classic. I love those fills. Oh man, that was classic. Listen to that. Listen to Ed Whistle's bass solo right here. Oh man, it was so awesome. Ah, they're simmering it down a little bit. Building it back up again here. Ah, the old pick slide. Adding a little uh, rough uh, jagged edge to the song here. Finger style, look at that. And a little something extra. They're pretty much improvising this as they're going. Adding all kinds of new things. And this is how bands can get after being together for so long. Ah, oh, a little light show. Look at that. Wow, what are we what are we looking at, everyone? What is this? Who is that? Who is that back there? Is that Daltrey? Wow. This is far out. Yeah, that's Daltrey. Look at that. That's like high tech, man. 1978, that's like, wow. What am I witnessing, right? Am I in outer space? Am I on, in, on some other plane, in some other realm? What's going on here, huh? How are we gonna get back into the song? Wow, look at all those. 
all those toms, man. Jeez. The boy likes his toms. Big scream. Oh, is that classic? Oh, the power slide. Look at that, huh? Oh. Oh my gosh. It was like it was choreographed, right? Amazing. insane thanks for hanging out with me watching the who perform won't get fooled again i'll see you guys next time in the next video when i do another deep dive analysis into some other realm of rock or metal or any other genre out there i'll see you guys next time like and subscribe